It's time for Who Wrote Wrote That that Comment? comment? It's potential. Oh my gosh, Shiny Gojo. I almost want to do a Who Drew That Artwork? But yeah, here's some art. Thank you. I have that one person that recorded for me while I was away here in the call. Hello, Toadboygany number two. Hi. Okay. Um, first of all, guys, look at this effect that you get from placing Lucy as your first unit. This is actually kind of cool. She gets like the little constellations around her, um, which means I get the little constellations around me, which makes it look like I have a unique passive on me. Because, you know, Toadboy Gaming's unique. That's why he's number two. That's why I'm Toadboy Gaming. Make sense? Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, we've been at this for what? Like an hour now on this infinite run yeah it's been a long time man it's been a pretty long time um it looks like we're gonna lose at around wave 60 i did bring two units that you know aren't maxed out and they're not evolved yet so we we got pretty far for having what we had at our disposal if that makes sense you know so the point of this video though is that we're gonna evolve megumi unique that Toad Boy Gaming 2 managed to get for our account, which is super exciting. So we're on wave 59. We're about to get a ton of gems. And like I said, we probably could have gotten a lot further, but we're actually kind of trying to lose. I kind of want Lucy to stop being good when it comes to like end modes like this. You know what I mean? Where'd you go? Yep. Where'd you go? You were just right next to me. I I wanted to buff. Oh, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> That's true. We do need buffs. Look, like, we can't lose this corner because of Lucy. We're about to lose the corner, but, like, Lucy held it off for... Oh, my gosh! A great threat approaches? Wait, we another actually boss. can get a reward for that. What? Be another Mahito. I think we should wait and kill the boss. You know how you can sell your units at the end? Mm-hmm. We should wait and sell our units so we can kill that boss. Please... It, it, it doesn't even matter if it's not an Akito, as long as it's like someone of the last three maps. So, I think that's what we'll do. We'll, we'll, we'll be right back. We'll try to fight that boss, and then we'll get to the part where we can actually like go evolve. Um, oh, I almost called him Minato, and now I can't remember his name. Say his name, please. Megumi? <laughs> Megumi, there we go. Guys, I, I've had a long night, okay? And the night hasn't even ended yet, because we're still making this video. It's Death, Shigura. painting, Aww. curse. Oh, I don't really care about that. <laughs> yeah, we can just we can just lose. We can technically just lose, but uh, yeah, Lucy, lose, please. <laughs> oh man, look at this, Aquarius and Leo both spawned. Oh, there we go, we finally lost. Alrighty, <laughs> wave 60, we got a few levels, not that many, but he's, you know, level 85, level 73, Ooh. 472 gems, and it only took us 48 minutes. That wasn't as I long got, as I thought it was. So yeah, I got eight talismans, so I'm, I'm satisfied. I got four, so I'm satisfied. Literally, all I needed was two. Imagine I didn't get two and I actually got zero out of that run. That would that have would been be pretty sad. embarrassing. I want to see how many eyes I got because uh, I know I got one at least. So, you know what's interesting? Ethereal actually got Gojo relatively quickly. And then he got Megumi even quicker. Megumi, sorry. Well, that's so creepy. What is? The eye. The eye? Oh, that yeah. is kind of creepy. Who's that for? It's for Gojo. Oh, wait. That's Kilo's item. Oh, no, no, no. I was talking about the, uh, like, in my inventory. Oh, okay, okay. Let me look at the items. Oh, that is a creepy eye. Oh, my gosh. We didn't get a secret boss. I just realized. Rikugan eye required to evolve a special unit. Um, wait, what? Do you need six of those? I think so. I'm going to go talk to him right now to find out. Gojo has six eyes. <laughs> That's, the, that's his clan. Oh, uh, okay, okay. Let me see real quick. Just before we evolve Megumi, I want to see how it evolving him works. This unit is locked. Of course it is. I know it's locked. It's because I didn't want to lose it. But I got Divine on my Gojo. Sneak peek for my future videos. Ha, 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 ha. Okay. Unlock and unequip my unique Megumi. Let's just see. Evolve Gojo. Okay, so we need that other eye for Evolving Gojo. Yeah, you need to bring him six, and then he'll give you one. I he'll see. He'll give you the six eyes. Gojo's yeah. six eyes. I see it right there. Okay, that's pretty cool. That's Gojo, but that's not the point of this video. Let's go ahead and see what Megumi Meguni 
Uh, I can't say his name. Megumi? Yeah. Sushiguro? It takes two of the Shadow Wolves and then 40 tokens, tickets, talismans, whatever you want to call them, and he'll get plus 20% attack, curse technique, and shadow garden. So I'm excited. Let's go ahead and evolve in three, two, one. There he is. Oh, whoa. Whoa, he looks scary. I'm like showing Ethereal right now, like what it looks like. And this is a really scary looking yeah. Megumi. Yeah. That's sick. And he's unique. Wonder who did that. <laughs> uh, anyways, let's go ahead and do a quick little showcase of him in the story mode. Uh, or yeah, just a quick story mode. Um, here he is. His stats are 5,747 damage, 7 SPA, and 18.3 range. So I'm kind of excited to see what he can do. Oh, also my daily test request. Wow, I just stroked again. My daily quest reset. <laughs> I'll be right back. Hold on. Bad. So I lied. We went ahead and did a Nanic Infinite because uh, Toad Boy gaining two over here. Didn't understand what I was saying, but but that's okay. That's okay. You know, that. and Lauren Lenny better teach the better ingredients. Papa Russo. Papa Russo. There we go. Okay. So we got 53k. His Gojo Nojos are doing a lot of work there, but uh, I think it's time you get rid of them. And then we go ahead and disable attack effects off. And here is Megumi. So I'll go ahead and place him right there. On placement, he does 5,700 damage, 7 SPA, and 18.3 range, which is pretty good. Not going to lie. He does that little cursed technique. Let's see what it looks like real quick. He, like, spawns the wolf and the wolf slashes him. That's pretty cool. The wolf, the wolf, it kind of looks... Uh, yeah, the wolf does look a little wonky. Scuff, but, yeah. But, but that's okay. It's a wolf. That's the first upgrade, 11,000 damage, 6.6 .6 SPA in 18 range. Next upgrade will cost 3,000, 18K damage, 6.6, .6, 19 range. Next upgrade again is once again another 3,000 with the same ability with the wolf. So there it is. He's at his maximum wolfness right now. Um, wolfness. Wolfness, doing 25,000 damage, 6.2 6 .2 seconds with 20 range. That's pretty good that's right there like it's a level 100 unit honestly like that's a basic level 100 unit right there so pretty cool that's pretty cool that is pretty cool but here's his owl summon he's at 33,000 range or damage wow 33,000 range. range he can hit every character on every single server on anime adventures um 33,000 damage 5.7 sta 21 range and he also does curse if you guys don't know what curse is blackbeard also has curse curse makes it so units take an extra 15 percent damage yes better pizza better ingredients better damage um so that's his first owl upgrade second upgrade right there third upgrade and then he has an actual fourth upgrade so this is maximum owl right here at 50 or 67,000 damage 5.3 spa and 22.9 range honestly unique on negoni may not be the best passive because of the curse if that's what you're looking for is a curse unit and they not be the best passive but we got unique and i'm not complaining okay Alrighty, thank you, Thiru. Next upgrade is Shadow Garden. You guys can see it costs 11,000 Yenaroos, and it'll be 101,000 damage Holy. right there. Whoa. Every 7.5 seconds? That's pretty sick. Hold on. That was pretty cool. That was pretty cool. He spawns like a lake, and they all kind of just spawn and attack. Oh, and he also throws out the wolf and the Wait, owl. Wait, he throws like himself out too. Look. I saw like a copy of him over here somewhere. Hold on. Is it random? Oh, it is. It is random. So maybe oh, he'll throw I just a seen wolf. Him. Or then he'll Wait. throw like an owl and then he'll throw himself. There's the wolf. There's him right there. And an owl. Wow, oh, that's dude, interesting. That's, that is interesting. I don't I know, know what each of them. Works. Wait, wait. Do each of them do like a special thing? It, it might. Like does owl well, stun? Is, is he fully electricity? Either? He is not, is he? No, he's like a circle area, like this big. So I don't, oh, okay. I don't know. Okay, so that's pretty big. Interesting, let's upgrade him again. That is him maxed out right now at level 86, guys. 
I, I uh, yeah, you know what I mean. His range is what's kind of yikes, but it depends. Cause I'm gonna put him here, side here. by Hold side on. with Coyote. Hold, Hold on. on. Oh, you're gonna max him out. Go ahead. That's him, Irwin boosted. That's not terrible, you know. Mm, I don't know. We gotta see what the uh, what's actually happening there. Like, is it just for a visual or is something actually happening? Right. Is Negumi like doing extra stuff? Like, is one of him bleeding? Is one of them stunning? Is one of them? It's kind of hard to tell because these enemies are honestly just dying. So we don't know if he's doing extra stuff. I would think that the owl would stun. The wolf does like the curse thing and then i don't know what he would do so interesting you know it, it is a maxed out unit that is unique is it he's at level 100 i think that's the issue because here's a level 100 coyote maxed out there's an 80,000 damage difference not really though if you think about it it's 7 spa versus 11.2 spa so basically every like he'll attack three times every time coyote attacks twice right so that'll mean 500,000 damage for Coyote versus 450,000 damage from uh, Negumi, which means it's actually really close because he still has 14 levels to go. You see what I mean? But the thing is, he has way more range. He does have way more range. So I, I I'm just gonna leave this here. We'll we'll figure out in the future if it's actually worth to get unique on this unit. Obviously, any unique unit is better than no unique unit, except for Bolna. I'm so sorry to the one person that said they got Bolna unique on my last video. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I hope you guys like this. If you do, make sure to smash the like button, subscribe, turn notifications on, and I'll see you later. Raise the pieces. Bye.